Okay, welcome to our Minecraft okay, Wait, page. that did not go well. We have to. Okay. <laughs> How do we stop this? Okay, wait, let's just start from beyond here because this was bad. Okay, welcome to our Minecraft civilization. Uh, so our Minecraft civilization is called um, Arania. And first, we're gonna start with our food supply. Our our food supply has multiple farms to support the civilization. They grow barley, wheat, veggies, and rice. The farmers also raise cow, pigs, sheep, and horses. That's not in there. And in chickens. The animals are used for labor, meat, milk, cheese, yogurt, wool, and leather. The water from the Sapphire River is used to help grow the farms and to drink. The irrigation system runs throughout the farms to water crops. Next, we're going to move on to the social structure of our civilization. This is the Queen's Palace, and this is where the Queen lives. And the slaves' houses are in the outer section, and they live in small huts. And merchants and artisans live in, well, in bigger houses, but the queen's house is is the, a bit a large palace, and it's the biggest house of all. Uh, next, we're gonna move on to the t advanced technology that makes our that makes our civilization helps our civilization's daily life. The Iranians invented a lot of tools to help their regular lives. They used the wheel, um, and the arch, and many other things. Here is an example of some of our uh, technology. Here is a carriage uh, waiting to be pulled by horses. Often Iranians, especially wealthy ones, use carriages to move throughout the city. And here is a another transportation that that most slaves use, which are minecarts and rails. And finally, and again, we're gonna move on to the arts. So the, the artisans, <laughs> artisans enjoy music, dance, and appreciate art. Um, at, at many holidays and banquets, and musical in, musical instruments are played. Musicians often play many songs at a wedding. In, instruments are carefully crafted by artisans. Often female dancers entertain wealthy citizens. They, <laughs> they wore colorfully dyed dresses and beautiful jewelry, as shown in that wood house over there. <laughs> this is an example of an art room. And next we're going to move on to the government of the civilization. So the government hall is the gray building next to the Queen's Palace. And in the government hall, um, most of the council sessions and meetings are held every Sunday. Uh, the council sessions are very important. And here is the council. So every Sunday, um, the, queen, the queen and her council of 12 uh, meet in the council hall to, and a public can also often come here to state complaints, make announcements, and suggest laws. The Queen is advised by our Council of Twelve, so the, it is a part monarchy and part democracy. Every year, the Council is voted on by the people. And uh, when the, they are taking notes, the scribe will write everything down, all the complaints and law propositions. And at the next meeting, the queen and her council will state the uh, decisions. 
Whenever the council is in session, uh, a blue flag is posted outside to tell everybody in the village. Next, we're going to move on to the religious aspect of the civilization. Here is a temple. There are many temples similar to this to worship the four gods that the Iranians believe in. The Iranians believe in um, four main gods. Radha, the god of fertility, and her sister Sena, the god of peace. The god of life and death are brothers and the other two gods. The Iranians build temples for all of the gods. Often the temples for Radha are under the earth, with, a, with this connecting to her being for god of fertility. Oftentimes, people pray to the gods of life to protect any sick, elderly people. And during war, people pray to Sena for victory and peace. Uh, many myths are told to children as bedtime stories. And often, people pray every night before going to sleep. Finally, we're going to move on to the writing system of our civilization. The Aranians... <laughs> Uh, Arnians developed a form of writing. They had 67 symbols for different sounds and had 12 vowels and 55 consonants. Most Ar Arnians um, could read and write very slowly, but the wealthy often were very well educated. Scribes recorded laws and took notes at meeting sessions. They had to write at the speed of talking. The Arnians wrote in a thin, on a thin tablet made out of dried sap. The tablets were less than a centimeter thick. They were made in metal molds. People wrote with, with a thin metal stick and scratched words in the sap. Then the stored the stap <laughs> then the stored in, in the tablets in wood boxes. Thank you for taking the time to listen to the tour of our civilization. We hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Yeah, that didn't go. Okay. All right, great. And then hit save.